Hey everybody, a quick check at some snowfall reports as a storm system exiting North Dakota, heading into central and eastern parts of Minnesota, where it will continue to wreak havoc into the overnight hours. Now, snowfall reports from people like you come in at different times, so some of them may be a little on the low side if they were uh, measured earlier in the day, but the idea here is we can see the track of the winter weather event from the oil patch down to southern parts of uh, North Dakota, northern South Dakota, and now is working its way off to portions of Minnesota. So as we take you in just a little bit closer, the color of the dots represent the snowfall amounts that uh, were recorded for today. As the storm system moved out of the oil patch up to the north and to the west, many of the blue dots indicative of three and a half to five and a half inches of snow, where in Minot we had a report of five and a half, 4.7 inches in the southeast part of Bismarck out there. As this storm system moved into southern North Dakota, as promised, or at least uh, forecast, temp we did see these temperatures cold enough for some snow, prolonged event, a lot of wind, 6.7 inches reported out here in Edgeley, prompting an upgrade to a winter storm warning from a winter weather advisory. Lamore, 8 inches, 3.5 a little bit earlier. Let's see, that was 8 a.m. 8 a.m. they were at 3.5 in that area. Now, as we see an 8-inch report at Victor, South Dakota, here in northern South Dakota, we did get a report in Hecla of seven inches of snow, a hecla of a storm. 6.3 inches in the Pelican Rapids area, looking up at Grand Forks between one half of an inch and one inch reported there. Uh, higher amounts though, as we snuck, are sneaking out into central Minnesota, starting to come in and the snow is really just getting started as it continues its way off to the east. Uh, Baxter in the Brainerd area, about five inches, five inches in Brainerd with a little more on the way for your areas. Man, you can go over to hetchesweather.com to see the latest on this as well. Let me show you where you can get this. It's right at the top line at the hutchesweather.com anytime, anywhere. You go ahead and scroll on this top line, snow amounts right there, Shazam. You can look at 24, slide the slider over, look at the uh, 48 to 72 hours of snowfall reports across the area. That's a quick update. I'll keep you updated with your forecast update coming up here very soon on Hutch's Weather. Thanks so much for watching.